So in this video, I'm going to talk about some of the muscles of facial expression and some of the muscles of mastication. If you didn't know, to masticate means to chew. So surrounding your eye, this circular muscle is the orbicularis oculi. And surrounding the mouth is the orbicularis oris. The orbicularis oculi closes your eye. The orbicularis oris presses your lips together. Below the orbicularis oculi, this muscle is the levator labi superioris. It's a great name because it tells you exactly where it is and what it does. Levator because it elevates. Labi means lip. And superioris because it's elevating the upper lip. Next to the levator labi superioris is the zygomaticus minor because look where it's going. It's going towards the zygomatic bone. And next to that, is the zygomaticus major. So those are both pulling the mouth upward at an angle. So those are both smiling muscles. Then this muscle, the rosorius, it's hooked to the angle of your mouth, the corner of your mouth, and it pulls it this way so it's kind of pulling your lips laterally, like you're pulling your lips straight back towards your ears. And then this triangularly shaped muscle is conveniently named the triangularis. It's also hooked to the corner of the mouth, but it pulls downward. So this is a frown muscle. So smile, smile, lateral lips, frown. And then next to this muscle, this pulls the lower lip downward, so it is the depressor labi inferioris. So levator labi superioris, depressor labi inferioris. And then on your chin is a paired muscle called the mentalis. The mentalis pops out your lower lip, so it's protruding your lower lip like you would do if you were pouting. Over here, this muscle is the buccinator it is a muscle which kind of moves your cheeks and compresses them while you're chewing. And we can also see the buccinator above the rosorius here. It's just covered up more. Now this muscle, this is the first muscle I'm going to mention that's actually moving a joint. Previous to this, it's all just been muscles which are moving skin for facial expression. This is the masseter. It is a muscle of mastication. So the insertion is on the corner of your jaw. The origin is on your zygomatic arch. Remember, an insertion is always going to get closer to an origin. So it pulls upward. It elevates your mandible, like when you're closing your jaw. And the last muscle I'll show you, over on this side of the model, when you're, when you're looking at muscle models, always remember there's gonna be the deep side to the model where they've peeled a layer off, and then the superficial layer. So on this side of the model, you can see the temporalis. Its insertion is on the coronoid process of the mandible, and the origin is up here on your skull. 
So insertion pulls closer to the origin. It's also going to elevate the mandible, which makes it a synergist with the masseter.